Hey everyone, Meteor Turtle here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Tales of Arise. We are finally ready to head out to the wider world. Ooh, what's that in the distance there? Huh. Looks like a castle or something. So far, it looks pretty much like what we left Your behind. I don't pick on the weak. Mine. Huh. Oh, oh, you thought you had me. You got nothing. Oh, oh. Got him. I'm sure I can put this to use. So What's he's still there? not some kind of castle. Yeah, one yeah. that belongs to a different lord than Balsef. Right, that makes sense. You said there were five of them in all, right? Right. We've still got a lot of work ahead of us. Mm-hmm. That's gonna be our next target, probably. Okay, looks like... Oh, gosh! Okay. Guess I misread the landing. <laughs> Sorry about that, bro. What's in the box? Ooh, life bottle. Okay. I guess we head back up. Maybe? <clears throat> Alright, so yeah, we need to go this way. Yeah. Yep, this direction. Rinwell, right? It's nice to meet you. Does that little white animal follow you everywhere? He's not a little white animal. His but he name's is. Poodle, and he's a baby owl. Huh. And he's the only friend I have. Okay. I'll take you all on. Take <clears throat> so he's you he's in our party, but he doesn't get like he didn't technically join the party. I don't think because <laughs> he's not actually. Um, he doesn't have any anything on the side there, and he doesn't get experience at the end of the the combat. So, yeah, so he didn't get any experience. So I guess he's going to be a guest for a while. Clump of translucent, lustrous crimson stones. Once polished, its inner powers of fire can be unleashed. Probably upgrade materials. drop on this guy what up <laughs> no choice. didn't expect me to drop in on you like that did you don't take your eyes off the cross oh these little ones are hardly worth our time less talking more pummeling cut them apart he's dead content we're in good form Make sure I'm still going the right way. I am not. I turned around. Another here. Let's kill these guys first. Out of our way. A lot more enemies out here. Come on, come on. Do it. Oh, I like that. Show me what you can do, kiddo. Less talking, more pummeling. We're just taking these guys out. Another notch in the old belt. Keep them coming. You like that? Oh, what is wrong with you? What's got you so worked up, Hoodle? Oh, there's an owl. Is that? Surrounded by hornets. Watch out! They know we're here. Flying zoogles, huh? This is going to get interesting. They're nothing I haven't seen before. Yeah, we've killed a lot of them to get to this point. I'll shoot them down, you finish them off. Got it? Bring it on! Knock a flying enemy out of the sky, and it's as good as done. Right. I'll see what I can do. Bam! I mean, I don't really seem to have too much trouble killing them, even though they are technically flying creatures or whatever. Still able to hit them just fine. What was it those Zoogles were attacking just now? It was an owl. 
And there it is. Is that an L? What? <laughs> it's nothing. I only helped because it was convenient. We couldn't have moved forward without clearing out those zoogles. <laughs> I don't know what's got you ticked off at me this time, but I suggest you keep your hands away from me. No one asked you to help. Rinwell, oh, oh, she Lord. healed its wounds. She's not trying to hurt it. How can you be so... Oh, that is adorable. <laughs> they look like they're talking to each other. He's probably happy to see another owl. I don't think Hoodle's ever met one before. What? He might have been wondering if he was the only one. And there he goes. Oh. You just barely got to say hi. At least we know it's out there. I'm sure we'll run into it again somewhere. Yeah. I'm sure we will. Right, Hoodle? Oh, it looks so sad. Okay. New skill panel. Shion Bombshell. When sent flying, press RT to recover and land without being downed. Okay. Sure. Do we already have that one? I think we did get that one. Um, increase attack and elemental attack strength when near death. Uh, I'd rather not be near death. Okay, or prevention would be good, but whatever. We're just going to keep gaining Let's SP. Keep our eyes on the prize. Wasn't there... No. Nope. Guess we got that. We already picked this one too. No, nope, we didn't. There's a. Skit. I'm always impressed how good of a shot you are, Shion. What do you mean? Just that all I'm good for is throwing myself at things with all my might. By comparison, your way is more. How do I put it? Precise. It's not like I'm that good of a. <sighs> Look, that's just how it is with guns. If you miss, it's a wasted bullet you can't get back. Mm. Is that why you're always aiming to exploit enemies' weak spots? <clears throat> I wouldn't say every shot is that deliberate, but that is part of it. For example, if I see a flying enemy, I'll often go for their wings. Also, if I see a jumping enemy without wings, I know they're an easy target because they can't get out of the way while in the air. Mm. In your case, I bet it's easier for you to deal with enemies that stay on the ground, right? Definitely. Things that can fly circles around me are a real pain to deal with. Exactly. It's important to keep your enemy's movements in check. True. Although your shots have the added benefit of stunning enemies, so it's easier to swipe materials from them. It's really helped out. It's nothing, really. As long as you keep doing your part when we fight, I'd say we're even. Hmm. Yeah, let's go ahead and collect this. Can't believe we forgot to grab that. All right, let's keep moving along. Let Campfire. What? And there's a fast travel point. Okay. Hold on. What's what's this guy? If you're planning to cross the border, you better make sure you're prepared. All right. Let's see. Weapons. We already have that. We already have that. So that's kind of like a. Oh wait. Hold on. Uh, buy sell items. Uh, yes. Okay. And then we got all these things. I don't really need to sell anything else. I don't know if this is one of those games where you can sell your old items or not. So I'm not going to do it for right now. Traveling is what helps keep this world connected. Stay focused and do your home realm proud. Okay, will do. Oh, wait, hold on. Hoodle! I love your glasses. And there they are, framed glasses. Thank you. I'm surprised there are owls here, too. Yeah, there are more of them around than I thought. 
All right, now let's camp. I don't know if I can cook anything, but let's see. What are you staring for? Do all Danon fighters look like you? What, this getup? I pulled this number together from scrap and parts I salvaged throughout the years. Though now I'm feeling self-conscious, seeing how put together you seem to be. Oh, oh no, I, I was just curious. Did you fortify your right side more because that's your dominant side? Partly, but mostly because my body's a little worse for wear after all these years fighting. That makes sense. So you take extra care to protect your dominant side with more armor. Smart. Is fighting all you think about? You want asking questions? Okay. What's this one's got a... I swear you can't walk five steps without tripping on a Zoogle. This is getting old. Guess yeah. we missed one. But wasn't it you Renans who brought the Zoogles here from Rena in the first place? They're not just ordinary animals from Rena. Each of them has been modified to suit a particular purpose. In fact, some Zoogles were originally derived from the animals on Dana. Or so I've heard. What? <laughs> you Renans couldn't stop at just the people of this planet? You had to screw with our nature, too? You can get angry all you want, but we have bigger fish to fry. So, are you going to work with me or not? <laughs> I will. It's in both of our own interests. Anything else I missed? Yep. <clears throat> Why am I here? Would it kill you to be a little more friendly? I don't see how that's necessary. Look, for the time being at least, we're working together. You don't have to make this harder than it already is. In case you've forgotten, the two of us may be working together. But the only reason we're even teamed up right now is because our interests happen to overlap. Otherwise, why in the world would I be working with a Danon slave like... I am not a slave! <sighs> I'm not a slave anymore. Not since I chose to fight. I've left that life behind, and I'm better for it. Understand? <sighs> I'm sorry for yelling. But please, don't call me that ever again. Okay? <sighs> okay. Okay, I guess those are all the ones that we forgot. Go ahead and do a rest. Yes, can I cook? Steamed potatoes and porridge. Defense up or heal HP. Let's do. Oh, can't do that one. Wait. All right. There we go. All right, guys. Ready to go? Yes, I am. So I guess now we're finally leaving the, uh, the area. The region or whatever. What? Ulvan Grotto. Okay. Grotto or Grotto? I think Grotto. I take it we're heading through here, then? Nope. Everything all right, Zephyr? Yeah, it's nothing. What is that? A ring? It was my wife's. Your wife? You never mention anything about being married. That's surprising. You said was. So then, is she gone? Was it the Renans? No, she was sick. I couldn't get her the medicine she needed, and then she was gone. I'd always wanted to show her the world as it could be. I'm sorry. Don't be. There are plenty of people out there more deserving of your sympathy than me. But... but uh, uh. Let's go. Oh, we got another... What is this place anyway? Skit. What's with these columns and steps? No idea. 
I've never been here before either. Rena's convoy squads probably used it in the past. I guess it's definitely seen better days. Mm -hmm. You wouldn't know anything, would you, Xion? Nope. And I'm not interested in learning either. <sighs> <laughs> Actually, these are Dan and Ruins. See, you can tell by the way the columns are decorated and stuff. They're all old Dan and designs. Are you saying these things were built more than 300 years ago then? Yeah. I have no idea what they were used for, though. It's amazing to think our ancestors were capable of making such structures. Hopefully, there'll come a time when us Danans will be able to walk through here freely again. That's exactly what you're fighting for, isn't it? Let's keep moving. Yeah. Right. <laughs> All right. Sure, grab some mushrooms. Was there a. What's that? I guess that's because of the mushrooms. What? The heck are these things? All right, ropers, and they're much Get higher level. There we go. Get a little stardust on him. Right, roll. Get out of the way. There we go. Oh, strike! Oh, missed. Get out of that, get out of that, get out of that. Here I do it! It's over! Burning strike! Aww. I'm Didn't sure I can put this to use. Strange core. Can we see what that is? Items. Strange core. Small mass harvested from a zoogle. It has a reserve of power that makes it handy as a weapon supplement. So yeah, probably an upgrade material. I think it's cool. What? Those were actually enemies. Go figure. Boom! Boom! Oh, killed me. What the heck? What hit me? What the heck happened? I don't even know what killed me. Oh, that. Probably that. Watch and weep. I'll bring you back. I never miss. Those guys are dangerous. By the power of water. That whatever that thing is that they're doing. I'll bring you back from death's abyss. Resuscitation. Did I get did I come back? Okay. I imagine there were Zoogles out there that could pretend to be statues. That's because Zoogles don't come from nature. Who knows what else is lurking out there? Guess All right. we have to be prepared for anything. Yeah, I need to watch their eyeballs. My goodness. Okay, so let's go. Let's see, gels, apple gels. There we go. Okay. We fight those guys again, we'll have to be a lot more careful. It's freezing in here. And after how hot it was outside, too. Mm. It must be the cold air sweeping in from Cislodia. It's the polar opposite of Calaglia, so I'd get used to it if I were you. Awesome. Is the little guy okay? Oh, don't worry about Hoodle. He's from Cislodia. <laughs> Probably just nerves is all. He's not really used to being around other people this much. Rinwell, how about filling them in on what to expect from Cislodia? Oh, yeah. Hmm, let's see. Well, for starters, nobody trusts nobody. Come again? Just like I said, you never know when snake eyes are watching you. Snake eyes. That's what they call their lord's henchmen, apparently. Their official title is the Bureau of Civil Observation. They've got cronies undercover everywhere, observing us at all times. 
So? Renin surveillance was an everyday part of life in Calaglia. Difference is, in Cislodia, it's not just Renin's. They've got Dan and spying on each other, too. Or in other words, there's the Snake Eyes themselves, plus all their small-time informants. All it takes is someone squealing on you, and it's straight to labor camp. No questions asked, no goodbyes. Of course, informers are rewarded handsomely for their deceit. Everyone's mm. always got one eye open, waiting for the moment to inform on someone before being tattled on first. Hence the not trusting one another, huh? In that case, what do you think they'll make of us? Hard to say. Although, not being from Cislodia will probably help, honestly. <laughs> More trustful of outsiders than even your own people. Why go along with it, though? Why doesn't anyone take a stand? Not everyone is strong enough to stand, Alfin. That's why the world needs people like us. <laughs> Alright, that seems like a good place to end this video. Next time we'll continue carrying on through the sewers here and see what's going on with these people. Alright, until next time, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I hope you have a fantastic day. Thanks for watching.